the Vala taking too long? I think she says she's close by. Yeah, she's close by. Oh, here Hi, she comes. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Hi. How are you? <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Okay. Hey girl, how are you doing? I hope I can keep you girls waiting for you. Of two course minutes. you did. I'm sorry. What's up, girl? You look so excited. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Guess what? But yes. Thank you already. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll tell you. Benjamin and I are getting married. <laughs> Going to come back later, or you're not happy that she's getting married. Why will I be happy that she's getting married to a wolf? Of course, he's your cousin, so you won't tell her the truth, won't you? Oh, what the hell is wrong with you? Why would you call my cousin a wolf? Avala, you're like a sister to me, and I will never lie to you. Benjamin doesn't deserve you. I mean, I have not seen any meaningful thing he has done in your life. As far as I'm concerned, he's just in this relationship because of what you got to offer. Benjamin has probably times without number that he loves me. I don't know why you don't like me. Don't mind. You know she's very jealous and very pretty. Just because she can't find a man to call her own. That's why she's jealous that you are getting married. Don't you dare insult me. I'm not talking to you, you dummy. You are okay. the dummy here. Go and find yourself a man before you open your mouth and advise anybody. You know what? Please. I think I'm out of here. Go, 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 I totally agree with you, and um, <clears throat> but I have been thinking, you know, been thinking about this one thing in particular, babe. Where do we stay after our wedding? You know, I've been thinking about where are we going to live? Yeah. Have you forgotten that we had a discussion and agreed that we will both live here once we get married? Hey, no, we kind of talked about it, but it's still going to be a deal, babe. Come on, look at it. It's your place. Move into your place before you know people will start to talk like this guy. Babe, hey, let them talk. Who cares? I mean, this house is big enough and conducive for us. So why not? Oh. Would you rather we move into yours? How can we even move into my house? My house is not conducive for us. I'm just thinking more bigger. You're thinking better for us, babe. Okay. What do you suggest? What I'm suggesting, or oh, just my own <clears throat> two cents, um, they will could probably sell this place. You know, and move to a bigger house, man. That would be cool. What? Yeah. How could you suggest that I sell this house? This is my inheritance. My parents will turn in their grave if I do that. Baby. Baby, come on. Listen to me. Don't be like this. Baby, you know what? Um, I just want us to think out of the box. Think more modern, you know. Your parents, they've done what they, they, they could for you. You understand? It's not like you're selling the house to go and squander the money. You're selling the house to get a bigger, better house. And I'm sure they will be proud of you. Babe, 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 I can't. My father specifically said... He wanted me and whoever I was going to get married to, to stay in this house. And I made a promise. I can't. All right. You know what? I will move in with you, babe. It's not a problem. You know I love you. 
but um, under one condition. I mean, it makes sense that you include my name in the documents for the property, you know, so that I, I can feel more comfortable that, you know, together we own the property so that, that you know. It's not going to be a problem. As soon as we get married, I will talk to my lawyer to add your name to the property. Okay. Mm -hmm. Baby, you're fantastic. <laughs> Baby, you're, you're excellent. <laughs> I want to apologize about the way Stella spoke to you the other day. You know how she can be sometimes. It's okay, I understand. You see, I want you to know that Benjamin is a good. Hey! Hi. Hey, bro. Oh, I didn't know you had a visitor. It's fine, I will come and see you some other time, okay? Some other time, where? Come and introduce you guys. Um, Meet my second cousin, Dylan. Dylan meets a valor, my very good friend. You never told me you had a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful friend. Aww. <laughs> Hi, nice to meet you. Nice. Oh, yeah. so fans. Um, yeah, it's so great to see you. I don't know if anybody has told you how beautiful you are. Yes. No, I know, like, they've told you because you are beautiful, but how beautiful. Hey, okay, Dylan, stop flirting. She's engaged. Well, as long as she's not married, she's single to me. <laughs> I'm not single. <laughs> well, I believe I still have a chance. Look at this wedding dress. It has a boat neck like cuts. You know, like, like the one um, Clara Kelly made for me on this wedding. It looks nothing like my hand's wedding gown. Okay? <laughs> no, no, really Claire Kelly. No, I'm Kelly. The designer that made my hand's wedding gown is Claire Wait Keller, not Kelly. Okay? Please, next time, don't do anything. Just shut up. Okay? What's your own. So, because of one simple mistake I made, is that why you are yapping me like this? Oh, I like this one. <laughs> oh my god, this is beautiful! beautiful. Ah, this will look so gorgeous on you. I know, right? Yeah, you <laughs> got eyes, babe. <laughs> Stop, right? Just look at, look at how the veil is. Uh -huh. you see the way they created the couple. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh my god, this is beautiful. Nice. You have eyes, Oh my beautiful god. Bride. All right. Barrister, man, I, I have a job for you. You know, my fiancé wants to include my name in the documents for properties, wants to get married. And uh, it's just a little thing. I, I want you to write Mr. and Mrs. Benjamin Backmuscle on the document. Uh, don't you think it would be better to include Mr. and Mrs. whatever her first name is, Bad Moss, right? To indicate that the property belongs to the both of you, because that's normal procedure with Does this kind of... Doesn't matter. Doesn't really matter. She's still going to be Mrs. Bad Moss. Well, so just have Mr. and Mrs. Benjamin Bad Moss. It's normal protocol, sir. Uh, we normally include... Are you going to do it or not? Barrister, so just tell me. I can find a different, you know, barrister to handle my legal affairs. Just it's tell okay. me. Are you going to do it? It's okay. I'll handle it for you. That's good. <laughs> nice doing business with you, bro. Yes. Okay. okay. So I, uh, uh, once everything you settle, I'll just make sure I, you know, get you involved. Uh, we'll, we'll meet her. We'll just talk about it. Sure. All right. Sure. All right. Okay. You have a good day. I like her a lot, okay? And I'm going to take my chances. <laughs> but seriously, Avala is so much in love with her feelings. But I really don't know what she saw with that good for nothing guy. Oh. Hey. Hi. Hello. Ah, 
What's the meaning of this? Uh, I like your perfume. Thanks. Um, <clears throat> I mean, I'm sorry. I don't know what got into me. Uh, I'll be, I'll be, I'll be in the room. Okay. She's beautiful in that dress. Should I said that first. <laughs> Thank you. Babe, do you find him attractive? No, I don't. The way you were staring at him like you want to eat him up. I really like him if you find him attractive because you should be dating a real man like Dylan, not some gold digger like Benjamin. Benjamin is not a gold digger. A man who lives off a woman is called what? Despite the fact that he works for years, he couldn't even save up to start up a business after he resigned. But he collected money from you and shamelessly left his house to come live in yours. Can you just stop it? Stop it! Benjamin never asked me for money. I offered to assist him. And he accepted wholeheartedly. A man who has wisdom would save up for rainy days. Or even collected money from you as a loan and pay back when he starts working. But no, Benjamin always wants more and more and more. Just because his business had issues and then I decided and accepted to assist him a few times doesn't mean he keeps asking me for money. Wait, wake up. For me, Benjamin has done nothing to prove that he deserves you. And you know it. He has showed me over and over again that he cares for me. And that is enough. How can you fall in love with a love life? So crying out loud, this guy with your father still what? So what? A man owns his own business. And we're free. Babe, wake up and smell the coffee. Benjamin doesn't deserve you. And Dilla does, isn't it? Just because he's your relative now, you think he's better than Benjamin, right? You know what? I think I made a mistake coming here. Have a nice day. Kavala, come on, Kavala! I'm feeling the truth, Kavala! He's sleeping. Why is he not picking his calls? The phone is not silent. Going. Fine, yeah, it's going great. I mean, it's you ladies that attach so much importance to weddings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, after the wedding, are you guys going to move to a bigger place? Nope. Avala wants me to move in with her, you know, she says she has to fulfill her dad's uh, death wishes. Oh, so you are going to move on the roof? Yeah. But, um, 
she agreed to include my name on all the properties. So I'm good. At least I'm going to have my respect. I still don't think it's cool to leave with her, but if I sit you. Oh, come on. It's fine. I am good and I'm going to be fine, all right? Don't worry. All right, and uh, don't forget you agreed to uh, do. You know, no, 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 come on. You okay. say if I get married before 25, you're going to so chill. Okay. All right, all right, so deal. <laughs> deal. Okay, <laughs> all right. Ah. Uh, <laughs> Baby, I hope this whole wedding preparation is not stressing you out. Oh no. Stella and Favor are helping me out. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. That's good. Mm -hmm. Favor. I don't know why Favor doesn't like me. Baby, she doesn't like me. She doesn't even bother to hide it. She doesn't hate you. It's just that you two haven't been getting along from day one. But trust me, she doesn't. Baby. She does. Look, I don't want to argue with you because she's your friend. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to prove to her how much I love you. How much I care for you. I'm going to show that every day. And I love and care about you too. Okay? Baby, you're the best thing that's ever happened to me. It's like, you're like a dream come true. And I love you so much, babe. I love you too. Michelle? I know. Huh? Yes. Come here. Come here. No, no, no. Uh, uh, no. Uh, uh, uh. I think you are dull in things. Favor is there trying to spoil our villa's mind over our decision to marry you. And then you were pushing up the wedding to April. That's too far. What if she starts in making her change her mind? Stella, are you going to calm down? Just calm down. April is just a few months away. It's not far. Avala is not going to change her mind. She loves me dearly. Avala is in love with me. So nothing will make her change her mind. Come on, calm down. You sound too confident. Because I know what I'm talking about. Overconfidence kills. Will you just get down from this car and let's go? Shall we? Fine. So have you contacted any catch up in the yet? Oh, Stella says she knows someone that is very good. So I'll leave it up to her. Stella? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I hope she doesn't mistakenly contact one can one tap at home and cook your food. Because the way she confidently display her stupidity these days is gross. She's not that stupid. Uh -uh. <laughs> okay, she says it. Oh. And then, you know, that might be Stella. You know, I told her to come, but she was giving me one stupid excuse. So maybe she can okay, okay. Stella! Hey, bro, dear. Hi. Hi, dear. How are you doing? I'm in the So you won't come? Why are you avoiding me? I am not avoiding you. I think you're avoiding me. You know what I think? I think you're attracted to me and you try so hard to fight it. I can see that Favor purposely invited you, but not only for you know that I'll be here today. But you know what? I can't see the problem. See? They didn't even resist. Hey guys, what's going on here? What's going on here? We're just having a chat. You know, a nice chat. Did you always put him out of this? What? I'm not going to let you stop pretending. Wait. Oh, I have to be. I'm out of here. Come on. 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 Come on.
bad boy. Mission accomplished. <laughs> What the hell is wrong with me? Why can't I get this guy out of my head? What are you thinking about? I mean, you seem to be lost. So, is everything okay? Are you okay? Yeah, I was. Uh, I was thinking about this. Okay. What about us? Sit. Sit. Okay. What about us? Sweetheart. Why don't we just forget about this big wedding? Yes. Let's go get married at the registry as soon as possible. Three months from now is pretty a long time. Babe. Mm -hmm. Babe, are you okay? Babe, are you fine? I'm fine. Babe, I thought you ladies uh, always wanted this big, elaborate wedding. What's the change of mind? Sweetheart. I want us to go tie the knot as soon as possible at the registry. Listen, I love you so much and I don't want anything bad to happen. Please. Baby, listen to me. Nothing is going to go wrong. I love you and I will always love you, baby. So calm down, you're fine. That's the main reason I want us to go get married. Please. Come here. 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 Baby, listen to me. I'm going to make you the happiest woman on earth. You have nothing to worry about. Come on. Alright? Stop worrying, okay? Everything is going to be fine. Okay. Mm -hmm. I love you. You know that, right? Mm -hmm. Hey, baby. Hey, babe. <laughs> hey. Welcome. Yeah. Come on, sit down. Yeah. <laughs> what? What is he doing here? He's the lawyer I told you about, the one who is handling, uh, including my name in your properties, and taking care of all the stuff for me. Oh. Yeah. Uh, do you know him? Uh, no. He just he looks like somebody. That's all. Yeah, he really seems like you. No. no. Hi hey guys. Hi, oh, Stella. Stella. Mm -hmm. How are you? Uh, so. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> Stella, sit down. It's this hot specimen. <laughs> okay, this is Dila, my lawyer. I know what my lawyer's cooking is. Yeah. <laughs> Stella, behave yourself. Hi, I'm Stella. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm Dylan. Can I have a picture? Stella, Dylan is here on a very official business. He's not here as a fling, so just cut it off, okay? All right. <laughs> anyway, um, so let's get down to business. Oh, sure. Can we go to my store, please? Yeah. Uh, Stella, grab a drink. We'll be right back, okay? So what exactly were you doing earlier on? I mean, you were practically throwing yourself at him. Oh, he's so cute. I couldn't help it. Well, Avala was irritated. I think she was trying hard to hide it. Our father has her own life to live. I've got mine. 
Seriously. Stumble for what? Each time I get my own personal lawyer. Go and find one. It's not a big deal. Please stop being overprotective. I am old enough to know what I want. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I'm old enough and I've had a lot of experiences in my life. And I have to warn you to be careful. You don't just meet people or see people and you want to throw yourself at them. Be careful how you select a man. Don't select a man because of how good he looks. Are you being jealous right now? I'm very good. I, I'm all comfortable anyway. Oh, shut up. Shut up. <laughs> shut up. <laughs> shut up. Come on. I'm out of here. Hello? Shut up. Oh, my God. Take this. You know what to do with it. I can't do it, Stella. This is for your own good. Stella, why can't you just let me be? I've done enough for you we already. We have come way too far for you to want to back out. And you know the consequences. Take it. And just do it. Well, you're not eating. You okay? Yeah, I am. It's like something is wrong. <coughs> hey, be sure you're okay. If I don't, I don't know what's wrong with me. Like, I've been okay. having severe headache, stomach pain, and feeling nauseous. I think I should take you to the hospital. We can just drive to the hospital tonight. No, no, no. <laughs> it's not that serious, but I promise I will see a doctor after work tomorrow. Maybe you have to. Maybe she, you, you, you're not good. You're not <laughs> but you have to. I will. Because uh, I wish I could take you, but in the morning I have to rush out quickly because I have this uh, appointment with uh, a prospective investor. So. I want to see him and see what comes out of it. Oh, okay. I'll come, I'll come home right away to come and check on you. Mm -hmm. I wish you all the best, though. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what is she doing? The other time I tried talking to her, she spoke to me harshly and walked out on me. She said nothing can ever happen between both of you and that she must marry Benjamin. I said I was even forcing her to be with you. I don't want you to fight with your fan because of me. Okay? Please make up with her. Okay? I mean, even if she insists on being with him, it's her choice. Just let her be. But she was going to stop communicating with me. Have you tried reaching out to her? You know, she doesn't have to be the first one to reach out to you. You can also reach out to her. You know what? Can you just stop discussing about Avala? I'm very sure your fan is going to get you something to eat. Are you sure? Yeah. This is how you want to. Eat. You don't like food. Why can't you something to eat, girl? Yeah. Ah, Amala, why are you calling me like that? Come in. Ah! What? Amala, what's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? Ah! Amala, what's wrong with you? Stop now! What happened? Avala! Hey, what happened? I was, I was, I was, I said, I got your message. I, I tried calling back. Which hospital is it? I called you several, but you didn't answer. So I decided to drop a message. But I'm already in the hospital. Okay, let, let's go. I'll just follow you. Let's go. Walk. Mm -hmm. Baby, you are not resuming work. You are not going to any office. No, I'm being truthful to you. You won't leave this house until we find out who is responsible for poisoning you. Babe, I have to. I have deals to close. I have contracts to sign. I haven't been to work for a couple of days now. Babe, I have to resume work. Baby, 
let me handle things for you. I can take care of everything. Like, I can manage things for you. Just trust me. Thank you. But you really don't know about the business yet. I do. The auto industry, babe, come on. I might not you know, be as savvy as you are right now, but I do. Babe, listen to me. I don't want you to do anything that will endanger your life, baby. You are not well. They just try to kill you, babe. And you are everything to me, babe. I cannot lose you. Babe, you're not going to lose me. Nothing bad will happen to me, okay? I'll be fine. I'm fine. You okay? know I'm worried I've been about you, babe. You know what? Let's start by getting you strong. Uh, what do you want to eat? Let me go to the kitchen and make you something. No, no, we're not ordering any food, babe. Please, I will cook for you. Okay. No, no, I, babe, what do you want to eat? I'm just, I'm fine. Go, you, you, so you said it's okay. Come, come on. I hope you're doing good. Now. I can't believe you're rushed to the hospital. No one told me. That's not serious. Babe. The doctor said there's an ammonium surface in your blood. And someone is slowly poisoning you. Are you calling it nothing serious? Well, I'm fine now. But I promise to get to the root of this. What I don't understand is who would want me dead? You know, I have a feeling that whoever is doing this, I'd be in your office. So from now on, you have to be careful of what you eat and drink. I will. Okay. And I've had enough. I've had enough. Don't come with it. That's on some lawyer that went and we got to the house the other day. Mm -hmm. I need his contact. Babe, to hear you say something very important, you're thinking about a man. Mm -hmm. Not for you. What a woman is this? Anyways. Mm -hmm. Is Benjamin's lawyer, not mine. Besides, why would you want the comfort of a guy who doesn't give a damn about you? Men do the chasing and not the other way around. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> that was then. Nowadays, anyone can do the chasing. And you see, I, Stella, I am going to chase Dylan until he asks for me. Really? I wish. Hey, <laughs> look. Do I just call us leave this place away? You're not serious. Oh, please. He's talking about you. You like man too much. Eh? I've always been man. You sit down. Just you know, you know, you know, every time. I don't know. I don't believe it. Yes. I'm getting tired. Uh, we are going. Cheer. Sit back, darling. Well, somebody recommended me to him, so that's how I got to meet him. Are you stalking me? What do you mean you're stalking you? Through the man you're going to marry? That'll be very lame, okay? And you couldn't seem to be everywhere. Not everywhere. What? Maybe you see me everywhere because. I don't know. you see me everywhere. Why are you trying to see it? I think I'm beginning to fall for Dylan. the way I responded to his kisses. I never wanted it to end. <sighs> I 
this infatuation has got to end. I have never felt so strong for anyone in my entire life. Not even Benjamin. Just confused. I think I'm drawn to him because he's a handsome dude. But I've seen a lot of handsome dude. And Benjamin is very handsome too. I think Dylan is charming. Benjamin is charming too. So what exactly is my problem? I don't know what is pulling me to this guy. Or whatever it is, I've got to stop it. This has got to stop. This has got to stop. Out! My head. Okay. Hey, baby. Oh. <laughs> How are you, baby? Hi, baby. <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. I'm sure. I'm sure. What's up? Um, babe, mm -hmm. you know, these past weeks have made me realize how much you truly love me. And I also realize that life is short. So why waste time in doing the right thing? The right thing? What are you talking about? Let's get married next week Saturday. Baby, don't you think next week Saturday is too close? Is this next week? No, babe. I just I want few people. Babe, listen. Remember that we already started this process before I fell ill. Right? And the 21 days waiting period is ending tomorrow. So I'll just go down to the registry and book us for next week Saturday. Next week Saturday seems a little bit rushed, but uh, whatever you want. I mean, it's just whatever you want. Yes! <laughs> Come on. Um, so, um, I brought the documents, all my properties. I want to include Benjamin's name in all of them. Why don't you wait till after the wedding to do this? What difference does it make? We're getting married next week Saturday. I just thought that you should start the process. How well do you know this man? Very well. Mm. We've been dating for some time now. Okay, I would suggest you try and know him better before you decide whether or not you would include him in your property documents. I think it's very important. Well, what are you trying to do? What are you insinuating? You think I don't know what you're trying to do, right? You're trying to poison my heart into leaving my fiance. No, no, calm down. Okay? I'm just trying to open your eyes to something. Leave me, okay? Really? You know what I should have told Benjamin? I should have told him that his so-called lawyer is trying to run me into leaving him. I should have. That's anyway, have a nice day. That's not the case, okay? Hey, calm down. You're stressing yourself. I... I feel dizzy. You feel dizzy? Do you want to take you to the hospital? Mm -mm. Huh? I'll be fine. Are you sure? Yeah, um, I'll take it to the Pass. Pass. Okay. Okay, well, I don't want anything. No. You know I can't get out for now. Yeah, for now, just homemade food. Just gonna afford to get poisoned again. Mm -hmm. Anyways, I came to give you girls the good news. 
My wedding is next week, Saturday, at the marriage registry. Wait, you're kidding me, right? No, no. Listen, I just want a few people present. You and Stella, that's all. What kind of marriage registry wedding is that? You are supposed to have a wedding that is big. Yeah. Something that is the talk of the town. Okay, how are you going to be in the bridal shower? I won't be leaning in the bridal shower. I'm fine. Anyways, it's your life. Thank you. See you guys there. Mm -hmm. Hello. <laughs> wow, this way you get to my office for the first time in a really long time. Mm -hmm. Everything is okay. Actually, I just want to be seen to you and say check it from you. So, okay. what's up with you? I'm okay. I'm okay. <laughs> what's up with your friend, Avala? Because last time I saw her, she was looking really weak. Just forget about that girl, please. She behaves anyhow. Can you imagine she's standing in the match with that good for nothing figures next week, Saturday? Yeah, she told me. Where did you see her? She was actually here. She bought some documents said I should include Benjamin's name in it. I don't understand. Are you know, Avala's lawyer? Well, Benjamin was the one that contacted me for the job. You know, he said I should, <laughs> I should add uh, Mr. and Mrs. Benjamin Badmus to the document, right? Which means it will belong to him and whoever he marries. So if he divorces Avala, she wouldn't have any rights to the documents or to the properties because her name wouldn't be Mrs. Badmus anymore, you know? Hey. I can't believe this. This girl is just so stupid. Can't you see that this guy is just so evil? After her money, yeah. oh, just me. Please, darling, we must do everything to stop him. Please. You know, I normally I don't even take jobs like that. But I just felt the urge to protect whoever Benjamin was trying to scam. And I didn't know it was Avala at first. I was so shocked when I found out it was her. So didn't you just tell her the truth? I was trying to. I was really trying to, but she wouldn't listen to me. It's very difficult to talk to your friends sometimes. God, just, just, just do whatever, please. Just do whatever you just, just do whatever. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Please, I'll sort it out. Yeah. Please. But enough of that. You came to my office. I can't remember the last time you came to my office. We have to celebrate this, okay? So, okay. what do you want? What, you want Chinese? What? Okay, uh, let's go to the. I want Chinese right. You want Chinese right? <laughs> yes. Let's go to the Chinese right. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to see the lawyer today. Oh, really? Yeah, I gave him documents to all my properties so that he can start to put in your name in all of them. Oh, baby, baby. Oh, baby, that was so thoughtful of you. Come on. Thank you. Baby, you don't need to thank me. Mm -hmm. You have to thank you. Come on. Whatever belongs to me also belongs to you, okay? And the earlier he starts working on them, the better for us. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I really do appreciate you. I mean, I I can't thank you enough. I I, I love you, babe. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, babe. I love you too. Sure? Mm -hmm. Yes, I do. Mm -hmm. okay. uh, babe. Um, babe. Hey, hey babe. babe. Hey, boy. Hey. Listen, I need to rest. I am pretty, pretty weak. Hmm? Have you been taking your drugs? Sit down. Yes, I have. Baby, are you sure? I know you don't like taking medicine. Are you sure you're taking your drugs? I know. Okay, let's get over there. Let's, let's just lie down. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Let's get up. All right. Oh. Hello, Barrister. Hello. How are you today, man? I'm doing good. Please have a seat. Thank you. Thank you. Um, um, so, my fiancé, she said she gave me a dog. Right? Yes, yes, yes. She was here yesterday. Oh, that's good. That's good. You know what? I want you to start the process immediately. Okay. You know, I don't want this uh, whispering so somebody goes to her and says something and she changes her mind. Mm. Yeah, so I just want it like, mm. Oh, point. Sure. I'll handle it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thank you, thank you, my man. No thank problem, you, no problem. It's my job. Okay. Yeah, you do a good job. Man. Thank you. Okay. I can't have a busy mind, man. I have to leave you. All right. Oh my God, baby, you beautiful. Come on. You're so beautiful. I can't believe this. 
wow, this is so cute. <laughs> I don't understand. Why do you smile like this? You look great. Uh -huh. no, it's okay. Um, I'm all right. It's just that I have um, menstrual cramps here. Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah, but I've taken something and I'm <laughs> sure I'll be okay soon. Okay? Oh my God, babe. God, why is Stella? She's in the bathroom. She'll join us soon, okay? Uh, okay. You're looking so beautiful, babe. <laughs> Congratulations. You're welcome. What is it? 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 I hope she completed the last dose of the prescription of the paper. Yeah, sure, she did. Then she's not supposed to be experiencing the same thing. I hope she's in care for what she needs. Yeah, she has. I've made sure of that myself. Okay, I'll give you her some injections, but I'll still like you to bring her to the hospital so we can conduct a more comprehensive test. Okay, Doctor, sure. I will. Alright. So do let her get some rest. I'm sure by the time she wakes up, she'll be better. Okay, no problem. Sir. Doctor, thank you uh, so much I'll for coming. I expect to see you by tomorrow. The no problem. Thank you uh, so much. I'm sorry I can't walk you out. Uh, no problem. I'll okay, you have a good day. Take care of you. I will. Uh, I will. Oh, baby, you know, I'm thinking we should. We should go for our honeymoon next weekend, man. Baby. Hmm? You know I'm not fully recovered, right? Can't we just postpone it? Babe, that's, that's exactly the reason why I think we should go for the honeymoon next weekend. You know your whole ailment is because of uh, stress and uh, a couple with this, your menstrual cramps. When we go for the honeymoon, at least you have time to relax, you know, rest yourself. I could give you some, you know, that my magical massage and stuff like that. Just take good care of you, babe. babe. But uh, I still feel very weak. I don't think I'm strong enough to embark on such a journey. No problem. We'll wait till you feel better. Thank you. You know, you are my number one priority. <laughs> so, I uh, can I just uh, rub you down, you know? <laughs> Can we, can we have some hey, action, baby? Please, I just, I just need to rest. I will be, I will be soft, I will be gentle. Mm -hmm. Just a little action, baby. You just like. Okay, <laughs> babe, I can just be behind you <laughs> and just take it easy, you know what I'm saying, baby? Baby, this is how I need to be. You won't even notice that it's there. How are your real stars, this? I'm sure because Abella is not married. Okay, I don't mean. No, don't say that. No, it's just I've been I've been very busy actually, you know. Okay, well, have you been? Fine. Fine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, I better said I should give you these documents that you can't take it from here. Okay. No, 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 you don't have to open it. They have personal oh. papers, you know. Oh. Hi. Hi, Abella. Hello. Mm -hmm. Good day. Good day to you too. I'll give you a favor of documents. Oh, thank you. Did you give uh, Benjamin his own copy? Yes, sir. Sorry. I did. Okay. Um, by the way, how is the investigation going? Any suspects yet? No. Not yet. Do you know, I don't think it's from the office. Because I stopped eating at the office. And despite the fact that I took all the drugs that the doctor prescribed for me, I still found ammonium sulfate in my bloodstream. So I had to stop eating at all. Then I started taking the new prescription he prescribed. I went back to the hospital for a checkup. The 
the doctor found no substance in my blood. Wait, does it mean you're being poisoned at all? No. I don't know. I'm even confused myself. But who would to poison me at all? Wait, why not just install a spike on me? Okay, well, that would be going too far. No, actually, this will help us solve the problem. I think it's a great idea. Mm -hmm. hmm. I think I'll do that right away. Please say, can you accompany me? Ah, no, I'm so sorry. I'm very busy in the kitchen. Um, Dylan, you know this very well, right? Why don't you just accompany her? I want to just tell you ladies what's the best way. Okay. Yeah. Wait a I'll just wait for you to finish from the kitchen, then we'll go together. Okay. Let me check if I even came with my 18 cards. What is your equipment in the kitchen, sir? This is it. Oh, shh. Yeah, this is it. Yeah. I might just stay. Shit. What well, I forgot my 18 card at home. But not to worry, I'll just rush home to get it. But I'm sure by the time you finish the okay, kit, I'll be back. Okay. No problem. Thank you. Yeah. And it's See you later. Okay. Why do you need to fool her? She's married. She's like, you don't know what you're doing. How dare you? How do you sleep with my man in my own house and on my bed? I thought you said you were cousins. <laughs> Which cousin? Benjamin? My man, I found information I planted in, in your life for personal reasons, and now that is achieved, I want him back. Benjamin, I thought you said she's your cousin. I'm totally I'm sorry, you know, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I, I was doing Stella a favor and I, and I started to feel something, you know, this this kind of connect and I, I don't, I, look, Stella doesn't understand what we feel, you know, I'm, 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 I'm messed up, I'm sorry. I loved you. I gave you everything. I know, I know. And this is how you treat me? No, I can explain. I mean, how she's messing things up. Stella, I thought you were my friend. This is how you two pay me. No, 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 she doesn't understand. She got me in this mess. Ah! Place. And she, you know, I, you know, we have this connect, you know. Can you just give me a break? Let's just talk about this all. Let's just talk about this all. Please, don't worry. I have a question, right? Okay, Because I've never heard you talk about somebody. Oh, please. I've never seen you with a guy, right? So are you not in any relationship? Not for now. See, dear, I have been bumped too many times. Mm -hmm. I've had so much heartbreak. Please, I don't know any man about that. I'm very okay, I guess. So what's wrong with your people about relationships? I'm really, I'm just trying to, you know, 
take my time. <laughs> you know, I don't want to <laughs> You won't understand. <laughs> you know what? Let me just look at it, okay? All right. I'm very famished. Uh. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Oh. I'm going to go away, okay? Okay. You again. Try it again and make sure you go six feet under. Stella, how can you do this to a lady like you? I was a very nice person and she doesn't deserve what you did to her. And you know it! Well, she ripped what she sold. What are you talking about? Go and ask her about a wicked father. Nonsense. Stella, you're going nuts! What wicked are you talking about, Stella? It's a lady that you are and you know it! It's a very nice man, Stella, you're wicked! Who will punish you? We try to see you! Okay, what? Who is my wife, Abala? I hope she's not at your house because I need to talk to her. I need to see her explain things to her. What is she? She's a less piece of trash. Don't you dare in your life call my name again by your cuss mouth. If I catch you in my house, I swear, if I catch your feet in my place, I wish I could talk to you. Don't you make this let it to your house. I don't blame you. Oh, I'm telling you, I need to talk to my wife. I hope she's not at your house. Just be careful what you say to her. I don't. I don't want you to open your mouth and say anything to Abala because Abala is my wife and I will come and get her. So if she's in your house, I know you don't like me. I don't like you too. But I'm coming to get my wife. Okay? All right. Coming to get my wife.
Something that you found now. I was so worried. Where is this dealer? We got a call from the office for an important appointment. Oh, I knew you didn't even say goodbye. You were sleeping, so you didn't want to disturb me. Okay. I need to go. Why are you going to? Anyway, I just need some rest. Be very good care of yourself, please. I don't want to hear stories. Avala, what are you doing here? You should be resting. You didn't tell me when you were leaving. You were sleeping. You know, I don't want to disturb because you needed the rest. Yeah? How are you feeling now? I need to feel back in my heart. I need to feel free. I want to be with someone that loves me. Please now, listen to me, Bala. Look, I'm sorry for everything. I never meant to hurt you. I got myself involved in the plot that I just couldn't bring myself out of. Sela orchestrated everything. She, she planned everything. She got me involved in this mess in the first place. Really? So, tell me, when you had the chance to leave, why didn't you? I tried. Believe me, I tried. I, 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 everything just became so much the lies, the deceit just kept mounting and mounting. I, I, I didn't know what to do. But I fell in love with you. And I really, really love you, Abala. Believe me, I truly love you. I don't know why I just... You know what? You two fit each other perfectly. Listen now, let's You need to be careful how you handle this, okay? So avoid bloodshed. Seriously, I don't think you can hold this in any longer. No, don't worry about it, okay? Just follow the steps how I laid it out for you, okay? Everything will be fine. Be beautiful. Don't worry. Don't worry. Everything will be okay. I need to go home. What am I talking about? Don't tell me that after all Benjamin did to you, you didn't want to go back to him. He's my husband. Where is your life? Leave it the way you want it. I need to go pack some of my stuff. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. It's just money favor. For some time now, you've been sleeping and eating too much. You have a fever for some time now. I think you should go see a doctor. No, no, no. I'm fine. I'm okay. It's just, you know, it's more sickness. 
on his sickness. Are you sure you're not? No. I mean, malaria. That was in the morning. Don't lie to me about that, okay? You might be pregnant. And if you are, I also know who the father is. What do you mean by who the father is? I don't, I don't get it. Of course, it's the husband. Once that child is born, I'll request for a DNA test. Okay? And if it's mine, I'll fight for the Wait, 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 wait. Wait. What exactly is going on here? Are you both having an affair? No. 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 It... it was just a long time then. Benjamin cheated. I was hurt and lonely. It was a mistake. What? Come on, we had a mistake. Avala. Huh? Yeah, that's right. I'm Dylan, Dylan, hey, Dylan, come on. What have I gotten myself into? Dylan, please calm down. Calm down, okay? I think she was ashamed to tell me that she slept with you. I don't know she called you the mistake. There's no justification for what she said. None. Okay, I think she's still very much into that guy so they can live together for all I care. Dylan, please don't leave her. Please, I beg you, move of God. I think she was pregnant and that pregnancy might be yours. Please, Dylan, please. Dylan, please don't leave her. I beg you, move of God. Dylan, come on. Father, when you told what you had with Dina and Mystic, you really hurt him. Were you expecting me to say that what we had was beautiful? Remember that I am a man. Married to him. That fraud. He's still my husband. And I need to go home and claim what is rightfully mine. There is no way in the world that I am allowed to tell her to take what is rightfully mine. Never. My father. Avala, come back! Avala! What's wrong with you, eh? What the hell is wrong with you, Avala? Can you just stop asking that question? Can you just stop talking about that? Listen, let's enjoy the fruits of our labor. We have a house, we have properties in our name. Why are you bothered? Are you going so worried about something that doesn't, doesn't matter? Right? Chill. Yeah. Uh -huh. you know, you mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 doing in my house. Which house? This house? No, it's no longer yours. Stella, are you high on something or have you had something to drink? <laughs> Madam. It's like you've not noticed that for some time now this house has been under Benjamin's name. You don't have any property no more. He has just transferred everything to me. So now this is my house. Stella. What did I do to you? What have I done to deserve all this? 
Do you remember? Many years ago when your father went to one oil business with one Mr. Ojo. What has that got to do with it? has everything to do with this. Your father swindled my father of his wealth. That led to his untimely death. My mother followed soon after. I lost everything. My parents, their wealth. And you know what? I vowed to avenge their death. Stella, my father did not swindle anyone. He also lost all of his money to that oil business. A few years down the line, he met a friend who helped him with his transport business. Lies! That's a lie! You know you must be true, Stella! Come on! Of course you would come out for him! He's your father! Anyway, I took my pound of flesh by planting Benjamin in your life. He helped me remove your parents' car break, thereby leading to their untimely death. Stella. You? You mean you and Benjamin killed my parents? Yes, of course. I needed them out of the way for my main plan to work. I promise I will get you and Benjamin arrested. Done. You have no proof. It's your word against me. My name is Barista Felix Martins. You are encroaching on my client's property and I want you to vacate this house in two hours. What are you talking about? This house belongs to Benjamin and I. Really? Really? <laughs> what is going on here? Can you imagine this lawyer telling me that we have to vacate this house? Mr. Lawyer, uh, this property belongs to my lady and myself. Yes. So, I don't know what the confusion is, but uh, if... You're not convinced, I can go upstairs and bring you the documents so that you can see that the property belongs to me. Exactly. Let me see the documents. All right. Just give me a moment. Okay. Um, Take a look at the original document of the house. What did you what did you even tell him? This document is fake. <laughs> You're joking, right? <laughs> this is the original document. It came straight from the lawyer's office. <laughs> That must be a joke. <laughs> Here with me is the original deed of assignment from Mr. Okui. And he willed everything to his daughter, Aval Okui. Yeah, of course I know, but she transferred this property to me in my name. Mm -hmm. So I don't know what you're talking about. What you have is fake. And I need both of you to leave this house and call the police. Dylan give us fake documents. It's not possible. True. Right? No. Can't be true. What did you do? Well, listen. I need you two four stars to pack your things and leave my house this minute. You, 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 I will clarify this thing, okay? Just, just calm down. I'm going to clarify everything. Uh, you, she, she's a fraud. She, I mean, she, she, you deceived me, right? Mr. Benjamin, pack your things and leave the house. So you connive with no, no dealer and that's what you did. This, this, this is not over. This is not over. This is not over. I, I, come on, don't worry. This is not over. Wait, wait. Oh, man.
Hey, Barrison, traitors! You tell me! What on earth are you talking about? I gave you a piece of job to do. I paid you for the job and you gave me the documents! Well, I'm sorry, I don't engage in illegal business, okay? Illegal business? Yes. Why didn't you tell me? You took my money, you deceived me! What's wrong with you? Okay, calm down now, call security. You know what? I will deal with you mercilessly. Alright. No one steps from a cobra's tail and lives to tell the story. I will deal with you. You think I have time for you when you were doing? <coughs> call the security! Hello? You know I will deal with you! Alright, Sam. Hey, 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 Sam. I will deal with you! I need you in my office. Yes, right now. Call security now! Call security! It's okay, Sam. Just left. Ask me faster with these things. Alright, take care. Forgive you like that after everything that you do to me. You are my wife. I'm your husband. Please forgive me. Let's move forward. You know? You need to make sure you're not my husband. What? That's my little fucking spirit. Come on now. That's not possible now. But how is that possible? If we got married and we. Take all our, our papers, our marriage certificate is it's genuine, it's, it's original. Thank you, Lady Miss. You don't think I'm stupid. I found out about your wicked plans a few weeks to our wedding. <laughs> I didn't want you to suspect anything, and so I decided to play along. I wanted to know where all of this was going to lead to. But wow. I was shocked that my own friend, Stella, was the brain behind all of this wickedness. It is Stella. Stella is, is, she's the brain. She masterminded everything. Look, she wanted to kill you a long time ago. I had to stop it. Several times she tried. You, you remember all the time you were getting sick? You didn't understand what was going on with you? She was the one responsible. Why? Why? What did you do when I was going through all of those pains? You even poisoned me! You were going to kill me. If you had a heart, if you, if you were even a human being, you wouldn't have allowed her to go through with those plans. I tried. I tried to, to, to protect you. I, I stopped so many things you don't know about. If it wasn't for me, Abala, you would not be standing here. If I hadn't done what I did, you would have been dead long ago. I'm alive because I was careful and not because of you. You know what? Let's just stop the argument. Abala, you are my wife. I'm your husband. <laughs> no, couples, they fight all the time. You know, we have issues. We don't move forward. Let's just forget this thing. We just move forward. I love you. You love me. Wow, it's perfect. Use flash, darling. I'm about to get married and I'm pregnant for him. What? You're pregnant for him? <laughs> that handsome man over there. Hey, baby. <laughs> Thanks, baby. Just expecting my child. I'm oh, getting married. You shameless traitor. So that's what you want to write. You wanted my wife. That's what you want to write. Don't tell me. Tell me what. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Don't tell me you want to leave me for her. What can't you just let me be? You must marry me. Marry you. Me. I am Detective Sam. Benjamin and Stella, you are under arrest for the murder of Mr. and Mrs. Edwin Okoye and conspiracy over the property of Agala Okoye. You have the right to remain silent because whatever you say or do will be used against you in the court of law. Do it, my Take them away, please. Take them away. Officer! Sir! Hack up them. It's not over. 
It's not the end. <laughs> it is over. You have no proof against me. You are so stupid. What did you open your mouth to say again? They have proof against you. Every word you said to me was recorded. Hey, 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 hey,